Hi guys. So for this hat we are going to use Karen Simply Soft. The color Plum Wine. And we will use size 9 needles 16 inch circular. So the first thing we're going to do is cast on 120 stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay guys, so after we finish casting on 120 stitches, we will continue to knit in a circle. We will knit one knit, one purl, for 10 rows. Okay guys, so after we finish 10 rows of one knit, one purl, we'll do one row of two purl, one knit, two purl, one knit, two purl, one knit. And then after you finish this row, I'll show you what to do next. Okay guys, so after we finish that first row, on the next row, we'll purl two, knit one, purl two. When we get to the knit stitch, we will when we get to the knit stitch, we will put the needle through it. Wrap the yarn, pull it through, yarn over, put the yarn through the same stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the yarn through it, put the needle through it again, wrap the yarn around it and pull it through. So when you have five, you're good to go. So, purl two, knit one, Purl two. Repeat the same thing. Purl two. Knit one. Purl two. And do that for the entire row and then I'll show you what to do next. Okay guys, on the next row we will purl two, knit one, purl nine, Knit one, purl nine, knit one, purl nine. And we'll do that for the entire row, and then I'll show you what to do next. Okay guys, so on the next row, 
we will purl two, knit one, purl nine, knit one, purl nine, knit one. All right guys, so after you complete five rows, so one, two, three, four, five, we purl two. When we get to the knit stitch, we put the needle through it, wrap the yarn around it, pull it out, yarn over, Put the needle through the same stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the st stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through. So we will repeat the same step from here, here. Purl two, then we will grab five stitches and we will purl them together. Okay, purl two. Put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the same stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the same stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through. Purl two. Grab five stitches, pull them together. Pull two. And we will do that for the entire row. And then I'll show you what to do next. Okay, so after the row is finished, the next step is to purl seven. And when we get to this stitch, which is a stitch we created when we purled all of the five stitches together, we will knit that stitch. So purl nine again. When we get here, knit one, so purl nine again, knit one, we will do that for five rows. And then I'll show you what to do next. 
Okay guys, so after we finish five rows of one knit and nine purl, when we get to the knit stitch, we will put our needle through it, wrap the yarn around it, pull it out, yarn over, put the needle through it again, wrap the yarn around it, pull it out, yarn over, put the needle through the same stitch again, wrap the yarn around it, and pull it through. Purl two, purl five stitches together, purl two, when we get to the knit stitch we will do the same thing again, so put the needle through it. Wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the same stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the same stitch again, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, purl two, purl five together, Purl two. So we will do this for the entire row and, and then we will do five rows of one knit, nine purl. This is how the pattern looks like so far. And I'll check in with you later. Okay guys, so now that we finished one, two, three, four rows of these raspberries. It's time to start decreasing. So we will purl two, purl five together, purl two. When we get to the knit stitch, we will put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over. Put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through. Purl two. Purl five together. Purl two. So on the next stitch we will just knit the knit stitch, purl two, purl five together, Purl two. Put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through. Purl two. Okay guys, so now that we've started to decrease, We will purl nine, knit this one. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to knit these five stitches together. So two purl, one knit, and two purl. Okay. 
knit this stitch, purl nine, knit one, knit the next five stitches together knit one, purl nine Knit one, knit five together, knit one, and we'll do that for the entire row. This is how the hat looks like so far. I'll show you what to do next. Okay guys, so on the next row we will purl nine and we will knit three together. So, purl nine. And knit three together. And we will do that for the entire row. And that will make our second pearl row for the raspberry for the raspberry. Then we will do three more rows of one knit and nine pearl. And then I'll show you what to do next. Alright guys, so after we finish five rows, one, two, three, four, five, we will continue to decrease. So we will repeat the same step as we did here. So, so on the first knit stitch, we'll put the needle through the stitch wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through. Pearl two, pearl five, together, Purl two, knit one, purl two, purl five together,
Pro 2. Put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through, yarn over, put the needle through the stitch, wrap the yarn around it, pull it through. So do that for the entire row, and then I'll show you what to do next. And the hat looks like this so far. Okay, so after we finish that row, the next step is to purl nine knit one knit five so four purl stitches and one knit stitch we'll knit those together Knit one, purl nine, Knit one, knit five stitches together, knit five stitches together. Knit one. Purl nine, knit one, and we do that for the entire row, and then I'll show you what to do next. Okay, guys, so on the next row. We will knit the three knit stitches together and we will purl nine. And we will do that for the entire row. And after that, we will knit one and purl nine for three more rows. So until we have five. Here. So one, two, so three more. And then I'll check back with you later. Okay guys, so as you can see, I switched to Boye 7 inch uh, double pointed needles. So, purl two. Purl five together. Purl two. Knit one. Purl two. Purl five together. Purl two. Knit one. Purl two. Purl five together. Purl 
purl 2, knit 1, purl 2, purl 5 together, purl 2, Knit one, purl two, purl five together, purl two, knit one. Okay, guys, on the next row. We will purl these two stitches together. Purl this one by itself. Purl these two together. Knit one. Purl two together. Purl one by itself. Purl two together. Knit one. Purl two together, purl one, purl two together, knit one, purl two together, purl one, purl two together, knit one, purl two together. Purl one, purl two together, knit one, alright, so this is how the hat looks like so far. Now we will take a tapestry needle, put the yarn through the needle. And we will put all the stitches on the needle. Remove the needle, expand this yarn, the working yarn, put our work through it, or you could just tie it in a knot. Alright guys, so this is how it looks like when it's finished. Cut the yarn, lose the ends, and your hat is finished. This is how the inside looks like. It's actually very nice. Thank you so much for watching. Please share and subscribe.